Hi everybody, I'm Cindy. I'm here with Protective Coating Company, also known as PC Products, and I'm here today to show you how to use Super Epoxy, which is a great household epoxy to have. It sets up in about 15 minutes, fully cured in four hours, and it clears, it is about a clear gel type epoxy. Um, and I'm gonna show you how to, to use it on something that broke. Here I have a coaster holder and the end side of it broke recently. So I'm going to show you how we use this. So you take the knot, the tip off. There's two sides, the blue and the yellow. I'm going to depress the plunger, mix out a little bit. And I'm going to back off the plunger so that I stop the flow. Put this on a paper towel. Best thing to do is to use some kind of little knife, putty knife, um, and on a flat surface, it's great to mix this up. The, this is the neat thing about the super epoxy. You know that it's fully mixed when the blue disappears. So I just start mixing this up, and as you can see, the blue has uh, already disappeared. So mix this up real good. Now I have about 15 minutes to work with this before it sets up. So you have plenty of time to do your, your repair. So you don't need to rush. All right, that's about pretty, that's pretty well mixed. There's no blue and I mixed that up real good. I'm actually just gonna put a layer of epoxy right here on the edge of this broken coaster holder. and thick so it's not going to drip. There we go. So I have a nice layer of epoxy right there on the edge. I'm going to do a little bit on the bottoms too so that when I go to adhere this it's going to stick real well. Don't worry about getting a little bit messy. I'm going to show you guys how to clean this up real soon. couple little holes that was supposed to fit right in perfect so it goes right in there I'm gonna push that down a little bit and that's that I'm just gonna let that sit for about 15 minutes and we'll come back and see how how sturdy that is now I'm, I have a little bit of a mess here that I made with the super epoxy so the best way to clean that up and make it nice and smoothed out. Use some denatured alcohol on a little rag or a paper towel and just simply wipe that off. Obviously you need to do that before it cures. So wipe, as soon as, that, as you're done applying it, wipe off the epoxy with the denatured alcohol and now you can't even tell I have it there. Okay, I've come back here. It's about 20 minutes later and this is all locked up real hard and uh, my coaster is repaired. Thanks very much for watching on how to use super epoxy. Stay tuned for some more videos on more repairs.